My name is Grove Pina. Students call me Pine, and so do friends. Um, I uh, taught photography at the Nelson Valley University's School for Art and Design in Port Elizabeth. And then I taught um, photography students, graphic design students, and also fine art students. Um, when I designed, I started a photography school, Pine Grove School of Photography, and that's what I'm involved with now. <clears throat> and my interest in photography started in Mozambique when I was young, and I went to live there for three years. It was a very bohemian lifestyle. And at the time I used Mozambique as a basis for exploring Southern and Central Africa. Through that time I learned photography and I became interested in it. When I came back to the Republic, I studied photography and then worked as a commercial photographer in Johannesburg. Um, at that time I was um, offered a teaching post at the university and I went to Port Elizabeth. Um, my personal style in photography is that of a set builder. I do a lot of studio work with the students and by set builder I mean that I like to control things. I recently switched over to Fuji films <clears throat> and the reason I did so was because of the quality and the compactness of the cameras. Um, the, the, the cameras are small, lightweight and what I find is that whereas before the cameras were so heavy I hardly ever took my SLR with me. With the Fuji camera I have it with me all the time and that is a huge benefit for me. I'd like to explain to you why the Fuji films deliver such fantastic quality. But in order to understand that, you've got to understand how uh, digital cameras work. Um, uh, you, you get an effect called the Moira effect, um, which is sort of a banding effect. And in order to stop the banding, camera manufacturers place a optical low-pass filter in front of the sensor. But that will desharpen your image. Fuji now came up with a concept where they arrange the pixels in a different way um, and they can do away with the low pass filter, meaning that the images are extremely sharp. Um, I was told by Fuji agents that um, the Fuji camera would outclass in terms of sharpness and tonal gradation my full frame uh, single lens reflex camera. I did not really believe it, I took it with a pinch of salt. But when the results came in, it was actually true. I could not believe the results. I'm now a convert and I am now a Fuji man. Now this is by far my favorite lens. It's a 56mm f1.2 lens. It's compact, it's fast, very high quality, producing sharp images. And for the work that I do, which is mainly township documentary photography, we work in small spaces and in quite dark environments. So the lens is superbly suited for that.